Hey guys, this is King Strive with 2 here, and welcome back to my Real Madrid Career Mode Series Season 4. And we'll start off this episode with a game against Chelsea in the European Super Cup. So for this game against Chelsea, I decided to go with Neymar, Bale, Messi up front, Hamas, Cruz, and Pogba in the middle. Defense, we have Alaba, Ramos, Varane, Danilo, and then goes De Gea. On the bench, we have Johnson, Casemiro, Isco, Dybala, Hummels, Carvajal, and Hesse. So we kick off this game against Chelsea, and let's hope we get the trophy right here. Wow, Lewandowski! Oh my goodness, he scores and puts Chelsea in the lead. Wow, when when did Chelsea get Lewandowski? That's not fair. How are they in the Europa League with this team then? Some bad defending, a nice play from Mullion. Crosses it to Hazard. Hazard gives to Oscar. Oscar takes a shot, gets deflected, and Lewandowski just gets the rebound. Oh my goodness, Bale shot goes straight to Courtois. And that's half time. We're losing the game 1 0. Oh, a nice save from De Gea. Chelsea are just going for a second goal right now, and we just can't keep up. Great. Tramp. And William missed that tramp. Oh my god, is that, is that a lifeline for us? It's a nice steal from Brand, and Brand finds the equalizer in the 80th minute. Puts us back on level terms. A nice play. Poor defending from Chelsea right here. Brand steals it off their number two, and he finesses to the back of the net to give us the, the equalizer. Ramos gives to Bill. Bill takes a fake shot. He still has the ball, but loses it in the box. But he gets the ball back, sends it to Cruz, and Cruz just... What kind of shot was that from Tony? And that's full time. We're going extra time for this game. It's one all. So we'll make some substitution right now. Take off Messi. Put on Hesse. Take out Danilo for Carvajal. And take out Hamas for Isco. It's a nice fake shot from Neymar. He sends Cruz through. Cruz gets to Bale. And Bale tucks it on. In the 112th minute. It's 2 1. Got a nice play from Neymar right there. Takes a fake shot. He finds Cruz. Cruz finds Bale. And Bale just takes one touch to shoot. And goes through. Yeah, it, was, it went underneath Courtois and into the back of the net. And that's full time. We win the game 2-1. Took extra time to get this win, but we've won the Super Europe Cup. And yeah, let's just see the celebrations.
to head in this group of players. So it's Rafael Varan who gets man of the match right here. He, if it wasn't for him, we would have never won this game. He found the equalizer in the 80th minute, and that was the reason why we went to extra time and we found a goal through Garrett Bell. So we got an offer for Casimiro right here. I did put him on the transfer list. I don't think I'm going to use him as much, anyways. So, like, I will actually, but. I feel like I should give my youth talents a chance and I know if I give them a chance they would go up and be much better than Casemiro right now so but I'm not gonna sell them for just nine and a half million I'm putting them up for 15 million and yeah they'll go for that so we've received an offer for Isco from Bayer Leverkusen they're willing to pay 76 and a half million, but you know what? I'm just gonna reject all offers from now on. So now we have received the offer from Barcelona. Uh, they want Alex Moimbe on loan, but it's Barcelona, and honestly, like I know they're a bit shit right now since we bought like most of the players and they only have Ronaldo, that's it. But still, even with that team, the, he still has no chance of making the starting lineup. Or even on the bench, so... It's not a right move, I was thinking of a smaller club. I don't want to straight up reject this. And now Dynamo Moscow hit back with a counter offer on our counter offer for the to buy Leinhardt. We asked I believe, how much did we ask for? I believe we asked for two and a half million. Yeah, I believe we asked for two and a half million for this player, but I guess we probably won't get that. So I'll just accept this offer. Now, Celto Vigo also countered offer our counter offer. We asked for 15 million. They're only willing to pay 12 and a half, but. I'm adamant on that 15 million, so gotta pay that up. So now we've gone to the Supercopa Hispana, and we have Valencia in this uh, matchup. And yeah, we have two legs in this game. We'll play the home leg first, and yeah, and Aguero again, coming back to face his old club. So pretty much, I'm going with the exact same lineup as last game, right here. Um, we did well last game against Chelsea, and this time we have Valencia, so it should be good. So we start off this game against Valencia, the Santiago Bernabeu, the first leg of the Super Copa Hispana, and let's hope we can get the win right here. We cross it into Bale, but the cross didn't work out. But Bale gets the ball back again, and he hammers it into the top corner. Makes it 1-0 in the 16th minute. It's a nice play. Messi won the ball. Tried to cross it to Bale. Didn't work out. But Hamas brought it, bring it back to Bale. And he just hammered it into the top corner. Unstoppable shot. And we're now in the lead. David Alaba. Peguli. That's a foul there. Oh, it's a red card. Oh my gosh, Ferguli got a red card for that challenge. I thought it was going to be yellow. Wow, early on the game and we're already a man up and we're already leading. Bram sends to Neymar. Neymar takes a fake shot, works out nicely. He goes for a goal and it hits the post. Unlucky from Neymar. And that's half time. We're leading the game 1-0 and we're up a man. 
Oh, Messi trying to find Bale again, but this time Diego Alves gets to it. Nice cut back from Neymar. He still has a ball. He's holding it off. Takes a shot, but gets deflected. And the play is over. Oh, wow. Valencia almost just scored. Even after being a man down right there. Aguero especially. But De Gea just came up. So we'll just make our substitution right now. Take out Cruz. And put on Casemiro. Take out Neymar for Hesse. And take out Hamas for Isco. Here's Bill on the ball now. Take the fake shot. It gets tackled. That's a foul for sure. Oh, what a shot from Varane. I thought that was going to be easy for Elvis to save, but he just messed up right there. Look at that. Oh, that almost went in as well. Um, that cross to Messi was horrible. And that's full time. We win the first leg, 1-0. So it's David De Gea who gets man of the match in this game. Keeping 5 saves and gets a 7.8 overall. So these are training objectives I set for my players and let's hope we get good results. So we get a, a slightly bad result right here. 1D, 3Cs and 1A. So Celta Vigo came back and said that they do not believe that 15 million was right for Casimiro. So they dropped out. And now we get an offer from Barcelona for Odegaard this time. They want 11 and a half million. And I did not even put him, put him up for sale. I have no intention actually to put him up for sale actually. And I'm just going to straight up reject this offer. I might be willing to sell him but not to Barcelona. So we just got an offer for Lucas Toro from Leicester City. A one year loan. And well, we are keeping Casemiro, I guess, so might as well just put Toro on loan. And I'll just accept that. So we got an offer from Sevilla. They want uh, our youth player right here. And I don't know if I should. Look, Sevilla's a big team, actually. He's probably not going to get any match experience with Sevilla. I'm actually gonna reject this offer. Maybe a smaller team. So the Philip Leinhardt deal has gone through. We uh, they have shipped it at 2.4 million, and we we're receiving 2 million out of this. So we received a transfer offer for Hesse Rodriguez right here. They want 32 and a half million for him. And actually, I don't have any plans of selling Hesse as well, so rejecting this offer. So Celta Vigo came back again. Looks like, I don't know why, but I'm still gonna counter offer them with the 15 million. Especially now since we lost Lucas Toro. Nothing but 15 million. So Celta Vigo came back saying that they're willing to offer nine and a half million now. And no, I'm, just, I'm still gonna want that 15 million. So next game will be the second leg against Valencia, this time at their own stadium. And yeah, and Aguero again coming back to face us. So again, I'm going to use the exact same lineup against Valencia. It worked. It, let it, it helped us get a win right here. And yeah, let's go. So we kick off this game against Valencia. And yeah, we won the first leg 1-0. And I just hope that we can win this game as well, so we can win this cup. It's a nice steal from Messi right here. Messi finds Cruz, but Cruz's shot was too weak. And Diego Alves saves it easily. So here's Messi that's going to take a free kick. Hopefully he can score from here. And what a goal! But it didn't count as Messi's goal, it counted as their own goal. 
but that should be messy to go and what a free kick that was yep I wouldn't count that as her own goal here's Hamas his shot gets blocked now falling to Pogba Pogba finds Messi Messi takes a fake shot but the ball gets stolen off him here's Messi making a nice run he finds Bale and Bale's shot gets blocked by defenders it's a nice through ball to Messi Messi's on the run right here he finds Hamas Hamas gives it to Bale and Bale fires in the goal in the 76th minute it's now 2-0 what a nice team play right here Messi was on the breakaway right here finds Hamas in the middle of the box Hamas squares it off to Bale and Bale just hammers it home so right after the goal we'll just make one substitution right here take out Hamas for his goal well actually maybe we could take off Cruz for Casemiro and well, we haven't got a chance to play Dybala yet this season, so I'm going to take out Messi, put Dybala up front. It's a nice steal from Dybala. Dybala finds Bale. Bale takes a fake shot. Works out nicely. Gives it up to Isco, but goes back to it. And, oh my goodness. a nice run from Bale right here Bale and wow he finds the second goal of the game makes it 3-0 what a nice run from Bale right here runs over a slide tackle runs around another slide tackle and just hammered it home finds the second goal of the game puts a 3-0 up in this game 4-0 up in aggregate Isco finds Bale. Bale takes a fake shot. Finds Isco. And what a dumb shot from Isco that was. Didn't tell him to turn around like that. And that's full time right here. We win the game 3 0. 4 0 on aggregate. And we won the cup. Yeah, and be full of it now going into the season. And I think this will be a team to watch. Well, I'm very pleased for this group. They're not the most fashionable team, but goodness me, they've worked hard. You can't fault them in any respect in terms of industry, and that's what you get. That's what you get. They are a tight bunch, and I'm sure they'll be uh, out tonight celebrating uh, as a team because they got this far and were successful as a team. So, of course, Bell gets our man of the match right here, scoring two goals and gets a 9.7 rating. So, I've done the exact same training for my players. Let's hope we get better results. So this was a bad result right here. We got one F, three C's, and one B. So I'll end this episode right here. And we have like about a week, five days actually, in the transfer window. So whatever you players you guys want me to buy or sell, just put it in the comments down below. And yeah, hopefully it's enough time to get them. Yeah, and I've actually put Messi on transfer list from the start of this episode. Never received an offer yet from him. So maybe whatever player, you, if you guys want to uh, sell Messi, we would have to like do a swap for Messi. Even though that will be kind of a loss for us. But if you want to sell Messi, that's the only way we could sell it. And yeah, on that note, if you guys like this episode... Please leave a huge like, subscribe if you haven't, and we'll see you next time.